EFT, Emotional Freedom Technique, is a practical technique very powerful as it helps removing blockages, releasing negative pattern, reducing pain and stress. And it also helps sort of reprogramming our subconscious. The basic technique requires you to focus your attention on your negative emotion you're feeling. Maybe a pain, can be a distress, whatever you want to work on. So while focusing on that negative emotion, you start tapping using your fingertips on some parts of your body, which are linked to meridian points. Tapping on these meridian points using your fingertips actually sends signals to the brain, to the amygdala, to reduce the stress response, which is linked to the negative emotion, thus bringing the body to balance. First of all, rate your discomfort or the issue you want to work on, on a scale of 0 to 10. And trust your intuitive response. Then, using your fingertips, your index and middle fingers, you start tapping maybe for 5 to 10 times on single different parts of your body, I will tell you which one are. You can either use two hands on both sides of your body or just use one side and just one hand. Up to you, no difference. Let's start by using your fingertips here to tap on the karate chop point. And while tapping like this on the sides of your hands, that's the karate point, and while tapping on this side, you just repeat the setup affirmation for three times. And the setup affirmation is, even though I have this, I would say, issue to simplify, I still love and completely accept myself. Even though I have this issue, and you say and you mention what is the issue, I still and I always love and accept myself. Even though I have this issue, I completely love, honor and accept myself. And then you start tapping using these two fingers on the eyebrow, and you repeat the stress or this pain and on the sides of your eyes and you just talk about your pain or your distress or your discomfort and then under the eyes and just say with your own words what feels in your body this pain and then under the nose this pain, this stress under the mouth, this pain, this stress. And you can talk with your own words. And the more you go specific and the more you go precise in details, the better it is. On your collarbone, this pain I feel. Under the arms, this pain. On the top of the crown, this pain. And you carry on for a few rounds until you feel a little bit better. And then you stop, you just take a deep breath in and exhaling maybe with a sigh, opening your mouth, let it go and maybe sip some water. Now check in with your body and see if there is any remaining discomfort. Again, rate on a scale of 0 to 10 and see if the discomfort or the pain has decreased. The idea is that you want to really go to 0. Do as many tapping as you want and if you want to carry on and reduce even more, in the following setup affirmations on the karate point, you just repeat, even though I still feel this pain, I completely, I deeply honor, love and accept myself. Even though I still feel this pain in my body or in my mind or in my heart, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I still have this pain, I completely love, honor, and accept myself. And then you carry on. You can use tapping for so many different situations and issues. And today we're going to work a little bit on different ways. So it's not an issue. We want to actually work in strengthening the connection to source, to source of all creations. So let's try together. Let's position ourselves and we begin. And just repeat after me, even though I don't feel connected to source. 
I completely love and accept myself. Even though I sometimes feel disconnected to source, I completely love and accept myself. Even though sometimes I don't feel connected at all, I completely love, honor and accept myself. I don't feel connected. I feel disconnected. I don't feel connected to source. I really don't. I would like to be connected. And there is a part of me that actually deeply know that I'm always connected. There is a part of me that desperately want to be connected. When I'm not connected, I feel isolated, I feel separated, I feel lonely, I feel I'm lacking. I want to change this. Sometimes if I feel I'm not connected, Maybe it's because, maybe I forget about that. Not because I'm a bad person. Maybe I just don't connect. There's nothing wrong with me. Maybe it's a program that I keep it from the past. I want to change that. I want to feel connected to source. And I want to feel connected to the source of all creations. I want to feel that connection. And I choose that. I choose to feel good. And I choose to feel connected. Feeling connected makes me feel joyful. Makes me feel part of something bigger. Make me, makes me feel worthy. Sometimes I feel like that maybe there is a fear behind being connected. And it's the fear of the greatness. There is a lot of power in the source, in the source of all creations. The source that creates mountains, rivers, the stars. Sometimes I've got fear, fear that maybe it's too much. Maybe I don't deserve it. I don't deserve that power. But I want to release that fear. I want to release that limiting belief. I want to be free. I want to be connected. Because there is a part of me that knows that I cannot not be connected. I, a part of me knows that I am a drop on the ocean. A part of me know that this is exactly who I am. Nothing more, nothing less. A part of me knows deeply that I'm connected to life. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. A part of me knows that I'm connected to love. A part of me knows that love is all around me. And a part of me knows that love is within me. So I reach to that part. I allow that part to come a little bit more present into my life. I allow myself and I give myself permission to feel connected to that love. I give myself permission to feel connected to that source. I give myself permission to feel connected to the source of all creations in body, mind and spirit. And uh, take a deep breath. And exhale, let it go. Release the tension. And maybe just sip some water to really ground and feel and check how you feel. Remember, you can do tapping as many times as you want using your own words. And the more you use your words, 
The more you go into details, the better and the stronger the effect. And just do it until you feel a sense of relief, until you feel a little bit more relaxed. And you can also use the affirmations and the sentences to really lift yourself up.